this video, you're going to learn about task timing options in Gantic. There are three ways to plan your task's length in Gantic. Let's open a task dialog to demonstrate. The first and the default way to plan your task length is by using start and end date. The second way is to plan a task length using duration. If you change the duration of the task, you'll see that the start or end date of the task moves accordingly, depending on which one you have chosen to be fixed. The third way is to plan tasks length using busy time and utilization, with busy time being the actual hours it should take to complete the task and utilization the percentage of working hours. If you set the busy time or utilization, you'll see that the start or end date of the task moves accordingly depending on which one you have chosen to be fixed. You can set default task timing from general settings and then edit it from each task individually if you need to.